kind of far up on the South Hill. We had a good one to one and a half inches of snow. Yeah, I was, uh, I'm up on Indian Trail, mm -hmm. big snowflakes, but it wasn't really sticking. You know, no. I, I was on the road about 3.30 ish, so it uh, wasn't too bad, but it was definitely a lot of accumulation. Yep. I saw a guy coming probably north of Monroe, north of Francis, and his truck, I mean, there was a good inch of it really? on there. Yeah. So, yeah, I was like, And wow. you know, the thing is that, Eric Loney, people always forget how to drive in the first <laughs> snowfall. So, uh, thankfully, right now, though, the roads are pretty wet in most places. Yeah, and not really going to be a problem. Looks like just slush on the roads this morning, and we've had the scanner on this morning. Have not only heard one or two slide offs, so it's been a, a fairly tame morning. Uh, people not really going to face too bad. I mean, just take a look right now. You got slush out there. Uh, different story around three o'clock this morning when we were all headed to work. Lots of snow on the road at that point, but it was interesting. Right at 14th, coming down the South Hill, is basically the cutoff. That elevation makes such a difference. There's snow on the yards and, and on the road above 14th, below 14th, downtown Spokane, just uh, very, very wet. So the city is not likely going to have to do anything with its snow plow. I don't imagine these plows will be out today. They have a brand new uh, snow plan they actually unveiled last year but didn't really have to use it. So the new plan looks like this. After two inches of snow, the city is going to declare a stage one snow emergency and then plow just the arterials. After six inches of snow, they'll attack those residential streets. The street department is facing 13 layoffs, so there'll be 13 fewer people clearing snowy roads, and the city admits it will have an impact. What that really translates to, to at this point is maybe just a little bit slower out of the gates because we won't have the staff on, on right away, but we'll catch up real fast. Now, to counteract that, what they're going to do is they're going to call in people from other city departments and then get them out on the roads. And you can see this is about what we're facing up here on the South Hill. Again, uh, the farther north you go, at least downtown Spokane, not a whole lot of snow out there. And I keep on saying it because that's sort of my test. It's that really good packing snowball snow. It's really wet, good for snowmen, but uh, not going to be much of a problem for your commute this morning. Nadine, Mike.